What's up guys, here's Claudio from Visual Motor WordPress Teams and in today's video we're gonna learn how to do a redirection after successful form submission using WP Forms. So imagine the following scenario. You did ask a form submission to unlock some content for example. So after the form completion, okay, after the form submission, you would like to redirect the to some landing page, to some confirmation page, to some thank you page. How to do a redirection after form submission? First thing, go to WordPress dashboard. Normally you can access it on WordPress on your domain.com plus WP admin or WP login, okay? So you're gonna be able to see this menu right here. Of course, it's gonna change according to the theme and plugins you are using. But if you are using WP Forms as I did, you're always gonna be able to see WP Forms into the left sidebar of menus. Normally, it's next to appearance, okay? Click on all forms and select the form that would like to apply the redirection after submission. Click on it. In my case, it's gonna be the simple contact form. Then review the left sidebar of menus and you're gonna be able to see setup, fields, settings, marketing, payments. We're gonna move to settings and then we're gonna be able to see a couple of options, general, spam protection, themes, notifications and confirmation. Click on confirmation and the confirmation type. This is the guide we're gonna be able to change, okay? Confirmation type, go to URL, redirect. Then you're gonna need to enter with the URL that I would like to redirect. In my case, I would like to redirect, for example, to the borderless page, but you can redirect to any kind of page. You can even make the redirection page open into a new browser tab. All we have to do is this. Always remember to enter the HTTPS before the link, okay? And after you have sure that you know of the page that you are linking, from you need to click on save change of course you need to clear up your site cache you need to review the form and test if it's properly working for your needs and you can always add a new confirmation in the case that you want or go back to show a page for example you can show a page and show a page of your website for example instead of a redirection but it changes according to your needs okay and that is. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I see you tomorrow. Feel free to use the comment section below in the case that you have any question. And that is. Hope you guys enjoy and I see you tomorrow. All the best.